Hello everyone, it's Dave Taylor from Web Media with another online marketing secret. And this week I want to talk about integrating your Facebook feed with your business website. And here's an example you can see of a customer of mine who has just recently done exactly that. And the reason is that they have uh, a website that they're very happy with, but on a day-to-day -day basis, this uh, this rural pub and uh, and kitchen called the Lord Binning uh, is very active on Facebook with its daily photos and updates about new new items on the menu and special offers, and it has a lot of traffic going through um, through its Facebook. But it also wants to push. Uh, its official website. So what we've done here is uh, you can see on the home page here is that we've created uh, their Facebook posts as a part of their uh, website or their official website home page. And you can do the same on your web pages using a fairly simple piece of code that I'm going to put um, underneath uh, this video. And you can just pick up the code change it uh, slightly as I'll show you in a moment to uh, your Facebook feed address and then drop it into uh, your home page or another page on your website where you want this live Facebook feed box to appear. So I'll show you first of all what the code looks like. Um, this is the code right here and it's not as complicated as you might think because the only bit that you have to change is this piece I'm highlighting right here. And that piece I've highlighted is the page address on Facebook. And you can see in this case, it's it says the Lord Binning, and that is the official uh, Facebook address for, uh, for my client. So his Facebook page is www.facebook.com slash the Lord Binning. And you would just put whatever your Facebook address page address is in that highlighted space I've put there. The only other thing that you really need to worry about is um, is the width and height. Uh, if I go back to the page for a second, you can see that I've specified this Facebook uh, box to appear exactly the same width as the content above it. And I've also specified the depth that I want it to be as well and you'll probably need to do the same. So just going back to my code for a moment, the place where you specify that is right here. So width for 490 pixels and height 300 pixels. Uh, so that's, that's all that you need to do. Those are the only two things that you need to change. And as I say, this piece of code will be under the video. Now, all you do is you take that and you drop it into the HTML of your web page and hey presto, you will see when you reload the page, refresh the page, that you have got uh, this scrolling uh, live feed. And as soon as you put a new post on your Facebook page, it will show up here on the feed. So uh, that's a great way to integrate your social media with your business web pages. And I hope you have some fun with that and we'll see you very soon.